Ronnie Eshel, an observer soldier, lost her life on the Gaza border on October 7. In the wake of this tragedy, her father, Eyal Eshel, has been passionately advocating to share her story and shed light on the events of that fateful day. To commemorate Yom Azikaron, he sat down for an interview with ILTV's editor-in-chief, Mayan Hoffman, to discuss her legacy. Take a look. Eyal Eshel, father of the beautiful Ronnie Eshel, thank you for being here. Thank you for inviting me. Your daughter, Ronnie, is one of the 60 soldiers, including 15 young female observer soldiers. Correct. Who was murdered on October 7th on the Nachalos base on the Gaza border. Yeah. These were some of the bravest young women who deserved to survive but were burned to death by Hamas terrorists while they were locked in their headquarters without weapons in such incomprehensible chaos on that day. Over the last couple months, I've had the privilege of getting to learn so much more about Roni, and I've come to love her. Tell us about your daughter, Eyal. Who was Roni Eshel? She was a beautiful girl. At the time that uh, she was burned, actually, two hours after she born, she was smiled for everyone. Really. She was smiled for everyone. She, she, she was a beautiful girl with... She was a smart girl. She loved the life. She loved to cook everything. She loved the kitchen. Actually, she was gorgeous, really. And she was my daughter. She was loved the, the house, her room. And, and from the, this story, we learned about uh, a girl, a soldier, that uh, was there in the minutes of a terrible, how do you say, a rua? Event. Uh, uh, the, the event of uh, the 7th of uh, October. You used to visit her a lot on Shabbat when she was on yeah. the Nachalo base, and you would go and sit in the park and you we would We went eat. there a lot. Tell me what you did together, what it was like to spend time with her. We used to go there with my wife, uh, Sharon, uh, we went there a lot, a lot. Every time that she, she stay in the, the base of uh, Nachaloz, uh, we used to go there. We used to go there and Sharon, my wife, uh, was cooked the, the whole food that she loved for her, for the rest of the girl in the command room. The whole girl was one part, really. They love the life. They used to live together in their rooms inside the base of Nachaloz. And every time that we went there, um, we saw that the other girls, the other beautiful girls, the other smart girls, like Ronnie. Now, Eyal, um, you have said that you are going to fight so that everyone knows what caused this disaster and bring the truth to light. What needs to happen now? It's uh, the hard part of the, the whole situation by the uh, October 7, because there's a lot of uh, 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 soldiers, people, that need to pay about what's happened for all of us, for the whole country in Israel, about what's happened in uh, October 7 because they knew everything. And they, they, all of them, they didn't use nothing about the whole details that they renew. Uh, they knew Meaning uh, that people many like your daughter before. had told them. What? People like your daughter had told them. Yeah. Yeah. And now they need to, to find out what really happens. Correct. So what do you need from the state of Israel? I want answers. And I want to be sure that the, the whole people that uh, belong to the army and they are one part of October 7 about the, this terrible uh, situation, um, all of them need to pay, pay for what they did. Because Ronnie paid, I paid the, the hard price they need to pay it also. 
Hey, y'all, we have viewers all over the world, a lot in North America, watching your interview. What do you need from the world? The whole world need to remember that in October 7, October 7 in the Shabbat, the Black Shabbat, for the whole part of Israel, uh, came a lot of civilians, people, that they are people, the, the same people that are uh, asking about the humanitarian food today. But the whole world need to remember that they are, these, these are uh, people uh, belong to the terrorist people. They, they are also the same people that kidnapped and murdered and burned also the command room, also the base of Nachaloz. And the whole world need to remember this. Thank you so much. Thank you, Mayan. Thank you.